further they've gotten away from the genesis of their power, the further they have declined, they have shrunk. Got it. So what sure, you're looking yeah, but... at here is this was a city that was built closer to the prime of the giants. Cool. And it is beautiful. Okay. Uh, so eventually all of them would just be like average height giants. Actually. Or like eight feet tall giants. I'm guessing the ones here specifically as well are probably taller than most. Yeah. Just because the, most of the ones that you're passing here um, are... Are 18 to 20, uh, 21, 22 feet. So uh, the it's also frozen in here. Yeah. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. everything is frozen everywhere. Uh, you do start to see more giants as you move into the city. Right. If you look through any windows, you see giants sat at their dinner tables. You see children frozen as they're playing. Right. Do we want to... I'm just asking the group here. Do we want to look at any of the murals? Because stone giants are very good about telling their history in art. Um, sure. Yeah, that sounds like a that, good idea. And if we can... Um, that might give us Find a, something that has a current date on it, that could also help us out a lot. I don't know. I wouldn't know if. I mean, it, it also type of giants do that sort of stuff. I mean, yeah. if hill giants do, I guess they. Do. Yeah. Well, well, I mean, any society in which there's going to be some kind of economics or buying and selling, they have to track things in some way, shape, or right. form. Right. Yeah. No, I get. I guess so. So I guess we'll look around then, we investigate all of us, right? Do you want to split up for a bit? Mm, I don't know about that. Let's split the party! No, 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 well, just in groups of three. That way we can cover more area. I mean, you're like every don't white person in every horror movie. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> you go into, hmm, an old yeah. city. Everything's frozen, everyone's probably dead. Let's split up. You check the running? cellar, and I'll yeah, check the house. Tia survived, because she's a fucking young <laughs> I mean, white girl. I mean, <laughs> but, honestly, yeah, we did the exact same thing on the last planet. We, do we don't know... We don't know where the temple is. Oh, That's yeah, a lie, okay, by the way. We should be... Yeah, we, we can split up, and we will search for the temple, and we will search for the, the art stuff that Vorian was talking about, and we'll Let's search for a date. Let's make a uh, meeting point. We'll just we'll. How much time do you reckon? About an hour searching. Well, how do you intend to tell this time? Can't based at least on what sun? Two of us can at least two of us talk to each other at a distance. Yeah, we course. still have the earrings. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, well then, I don't know what the range is on those. And not all of you have earrings. Oh, so yeah, make right. sure. Yeah, but oh, at least one of us can have earrings. So make sure at least one of us in each group has an earring, and we'll check in with each other every five minutes to make sure that we're within range. Are and you if, dead yet? No. Are you dead yet? <laughs> yeah. And if for whatever reason we we can't contact each other, we start heading back the way we came. Uh, well. Do you want to make this entrance the meeting point then? All right. Do yeah. You, are you sure we could just meet at the temple? Because if well, if Mister X is this. in one group, and Vorian I is in in another group, then it's, it'll be fine. Could just send out a flare. <laughs> do, do we don't we don't need to do that. All yeah, right, we're splitting up instead of arguing. <laughs> Could we just do that? Who's going with me? Um. Okay. Valley, I'd go with Mister X. Yoki, go with Vorian. And I'll go with Golurin. That's Wait, splitting why up. Why are you doing that? No. Why are we doing three groups? Each. Let's do. Let's do. Do two. Two groups. Two groups? Okay. No, oh, I just thought three groups would cover more ground. Well, we only have two people who guide us to the temple who have guiding spells. Okay, so so Vorian's group's going off to find art, uh, Mr. X's group's going off to find the temple. Yes, so, okay. uh, well, uh, we should I 
Yeah, well, uh, let's try to find the murals and see what. Uh, if we there can find out more about the everywhere. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it, in that case, just every, walking and every skimming wall it. of every house and every wall of every building uh, and every wall of every oh. garden wall yeah. is a mural. So yeah. this this is going to take a while. Like I said, but in, what we're this, trying to find is like dates and yeah. pertinent information about in this, what's going on. Yeah, just just to get it across to you, in this city that you have seen, everything is made of stone, mm -hmm. and there is not a single flat stone surface. Okay. Every surface has carvings on it. Okay, how about this? Uh, I will go up off in one direction. And I will try to find a place that looks important, and then I would kind of skim the murals, and then if I don't find anything, I would try to find next place that looks important. Because I'm mm -hmm. guessing that a normal house doesn't have the, like, oh, this is the secret code, but rather a grand is... mayor house, or I don't know, titan house might have it, or well, a temple might wait. have it. Can we see, from where we are, can we see the whole city? Like, are we kind of sitting, like, on an elevated, sort of, like, the city going down? No, once you've reached the city, it's fairly level. Okay, but we're, from where we are right now. Yeah, that, yeah, Valiad, yeah, do that. If Valiad, if you can fly up and see if you can spot a building that kind of looks like the big tower that we saw at the hill giant place. Something that looks significant enough. For it to be a trial there, or significant enough to lead us to the trial. Mm -hmm. And if there are several ones, then we split up towards where yeah. we're going. Yeah. Okay, Galia, can you do that, please? He's already done it. Okay. Cool. You fly up, you then look down on the city below you. What you see, uh, it becomes very easy to make out the center of town first off. In the center of town, there is a large stone circle that, if you think of, of like a, a town center park or something, um, mm -hmm. most of it would have like a statue of some kind in the middle, and then kind of an open area for people to view the statue, and then things of that nature. Mm -hmm. What strikes you immediately as odd, though, is that where the statue would normally sit. It looks like it's just a block of stone. That's oh, that must probably be the Yeah, the um, or it's like, just a very important, like, stone with uh, important writing on it. Uh, and you do also then notice near that, uh, they're, near, they're at the center of town, um, in the area surrounding that park, the buildings do look larger than the ones on the outskirts. Okay, so he flies back down and, and says there's a, uh, a large uh, stone monolith in the center of town. It's probably filled with inscriptions. It might be the trial as well because the stone giant's um, whole thing was stonecraft. Like that may be an issue because we won't be able to break through the ice. Um, so... Well, is... well, the last challenge chamber yeah. that we were in, there was no ice on the actual tables. It seems like the magic that controlled the challenge was unaffected by the ice. All right. Yeah, the well, ice is in my head right now. I was about to say that. Well, here's the thing, right? Do we need to look... I, I mean, I know I, I was the one that said it. Like, I, I asked the group if we wanted to look for things. Do we want to look for clues or things like that? Or would we rather just go straight to the trial? Because I, I'd rather go straight to the trial myself. I was only asking, just so. I, I mean, you know, I think it wouldn't it, it wouldn't hurt if we were to try to find more information about the trial. I mean, I, I guess we should go there first and then uh, figure out if there's enough information to go by there. And if not, then we will look for more. Okay. We should read the inscriptions leading up to the trial. Sure. Well, I mean, everything is... Yeah, everything is covered. Described, I know. So. I know. Uh, so just keep reading, then. Uh, I, will I know, that's what he's doing. Guiding hand. And continuing. 
Yeah, it's the compass. Uh, fuck. <laughs> yes, the compass. Is it, is it, is it leading sure. to the trial? <laughs> the compass. Is it pointing towards the city center? Well, that's the same direction as the monolith, so... Uh, at yeah, the I'm moment, asking, at the no, I'm asking. Yes, it is. Okay. Well, let's go. Okay. You make your way through town. Um, and it takes you about... 15 minutes at a walking pace to get to the center of town. Uh, Madmen, there's one to the left and there's one to the right. Mm. Um, and there's another one straight ahead. He, as they're walking, he says, there's titans about. I what? Think. What? Titans. What do you mean there's titans about? The, the I, I look sphere. around to see what he's talking about. In the buildings. There, there. To the left and to the right. <laughs> and up in front of us, there are several titans. What, like, not frozen, or...? Uh, frozen, but titans nonetheless. Do, do we mm. see the frozen titans as we look to the left and the right? Uh, to the left, you see a building with a stone book over the door. Library? And to the right, you see what looks like a very large building with a, a line of four or five people looking like they were on their way into it. As they were frozen. Yeah, I, I guess right I, when before, right before he says that, his crystal would have cloned a little bit. Like, mm. Mm. Do you? Mm. I'm kind of curious about that. If there's actually titans here, do we you guys want to keep going ahead and someone come with me and check this out? I you guys can come to win. Come with me. Yes. Okay. I would also like to see the titan. Are the doors there frozen shut as well? Yes. Okay, we're not going to go see the Titan. <laughs> well, no, I mean, we can... Can't you use your thing to paint doors here, too? Yeah. Or I mean, sure. If you'd I like me to. I kind of to trial, though. I don't see a reason to, but yeah. if you'd like... It's uh, a Titan. It's... They, they are very awesome. Cool. Great. Yeah. Fantastic. No, yes, um, they are cool uh, now. Your, your painting thing isn't going to cause any kind of permanent damage, right? It's going to cause a permanent door in their infrastructure. Then that might... We not already have one. There's no point at having two. This might as well. Hey, buddy. Uh, Guys, I'll be back in one minute. Sorry. If you'd like me to, I can. <laughs> yeah, I mean, just to check it out. Just sure. Okay, I'll do it. Okay. Plus, Titans are kind of important. Did so you guys get that we're going to be destroying their building? Oh, does it really matter at this point? They're all yeah. frozen. Exactly. Okay, okay, all right. So that's totally what I'm saying. Nice. They're all frozen. What's the yeah. point? We've all been frozen for thousands of years, but who broke my door? Ah, oh, <laughs> that's the thing I'm going to be very angry about. Frozen. What could be strong enough to freeze a titan? What could be strong enough to freeze an entire <laughs> sphere filled with titans and planets and other creatures all at once? Or how instantly. strong is the magic that wasn't affected by it? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Mm. There's no way that there's titans just sitting inside the house being <laughs> yeah, bored. They're locked in like shit. Like, well, oh, well, I'm, I'm not just getting out. <laughs> sit here. Yeah. <laughs> and hopefully. I'm not going to call uh, for little... help or anything. <laughs> if only a uh, little elf, a giant fish, and a crystal dude would walk in here and set me free. <laughs> <laughs> but what are the chances of that happening? Yes. Never in a thousand, thousand years, but maybe in three thousand years. Hmm. <laughs> Four thousand years past. Yes. <laughs> Ninety-nine oh. butters appear in the world. Ninety-nine yeah. butters. I mean, I... <laughs> we get in there. I called it. I fucking called it. <laughs> <laughs> it's possible to actually talk to them. Maybe in it horribly. It's possible to pain. kill them too, right? I'm back. Sorry about that. Well, they're easy to kill. Oh, they're killing? frozen. No, no one, no one. But, 
Did you tell everybody the results of your experimentation, or have you kept that a secret? Uh, no, he hasn't said anything yet. <sighs> Thank you. I didn't know. Yeah, but it's alright. Titans don't breathe, so even if he would do that, then it wouldn't matter. So what are you doing? Uh, uh, we're going into the Titans' house. Apparently, they want me to make a door in, in this guy's doorway, so I'm gonna do that. The one with the book over it. Yep. Okay. You make a door through the door. Yep. You step inside. <laughs> you see a very large room filled with row upon row upon row of what look like stone tablets. That sounds important. Can we read what's written on them? <laughs> you can read like the, si title. the sides. Yeah, like, yeah, exactly, yes, the title. Like, <laughs> how to pacifize for dummies. How about that? <laughs> um, you, you see, effectively, a library. Cool. As you browse <laughs> through, you see written on basically what would be the spines of these stones um, dozens and dozens of different topics is everything here just made out of stone like yes. there's no parch there's so the books are made of stone they're stone tablets and uh, the titan uh, you see a very elderly looking giant sat behind a desk, hunched over a book. Frozen. Like an actual it... book? No, or like a, a stone. stone book. Okay. Okay. But but this is uh this is the Titan that I What's he what's he reading? Uh, is it smut? It <laughs> looks like actually he was writing in his journal. Oh really? Ooh. Well oh yeah. yeah. What I will peak, right? Yeah, 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 sure. Do you read Giant? I read, I read, I I read do. everything. <laughs> you, say, boys? you basically read through a passage that he was writing that basically slams the youth of today for um, mm. not properly taking to their studies for not caring about the written word anymore, um, for being more concerned with um, with carving and with fighting than with documenting their, 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 their history uh, properly, and basically just ranting and raving that um, visitors to the library are at an all-time low, that type of thing. Damn you. Oh. Uh, is this guy as tall as um, Sevlin? Is, does no. he look as big as a titan should look? He, he looks huge for a stone giant. Mm. Probably 24, 25 feet. But okay. nothing compared to Svelton. How about, how about this, Casey? If I stand on the table, mm -hmm. uh, like where the book is, and I'll try to stand as close as possible to this giant titan, whatever and I'll activate uh, at the magic field okay uh, and uh, at the same time try to talk to him telepathically like, hello I am X who are you? Nothing happens. That's unfortunate. Uh, I think we should go to the trial. Yeah. yeah. It was worth a shot, though. Yeah. Uh, oh, I touched the ice. Okay. <laughs> Roll me a constitution save with advantage. Oh wait, do you still have the um you still have the anti magic shell up when you do that? 
Yeah. Never mind. You just touch the ice. And like nothing happens. Well, it's cold. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. But uh, it, it, the ice wasn't that thick, right? The ice is about eight inches, eight nine inches thick. Okay, that's pretty thick. Okay. Uh, should, the ice is thick to... here that it was on the doorway. Sh should we try on to? Him. Yeah. Yeah. Should we try to smash some of the ice open? Here uh, on on the yeah. guy? No. On the guy. That's not Tia, a, no. Tia, one with that revelation. Roll me an intelligence check. <laughs> you give me my intelligence check of plus two. Better than minus one. Oh. Oh, there we go. As you start thinking okay. back on that, you you start to realize that any time you've seen the larger giants on either world the ones that you would start to class as being titan-sized, the ice has always been thicker on them than on the others. Mm. Are they the source? No, that doesn't make any sense. Maybe if the, uh, the ice what do you mean? type of the spell. The ice was also thicker on the outer walls of the temple than it was on the rest of the town. So basically... Places of importance or people of importance or, or power are have more ice on them because it takes more to contain them, maybe? Almost like the ice was drawn to power. Mm. Mm. All right. Uh, oh, yeah. He's smart. He's yeah, or it was directed in some way. Or magic. Or it was works directed. Like yeah. gravity. Yeah. So, uh, Which, yeah, the actually, in spell Gemmer, you do know that magic does work like gravity because it holds air. Yeah. Well, deactivating the magic stuff again. Uh, anti -magic While you're touching the ice, you deactivate it? <laughs> no, I remove my hand first, Casey. Okay, just checking. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> like, we I'm stuck, on guys. Towards the, uh, towards the trial? I, if we have a direction to it, yeah. Yes. Still got my gun in your hand. Okay, you make your way through, you finally, after an, a few minutes, reach the center, where you see this, hu you now realize, humongous, uh, I'm talking about maybe 20 feet by 20 feet by 80 feet tall, block of ice, or sorry, block of stone, that is then encased in ice uh, in the center of town. Nope. Um, As you reach it, plot. both the compass and the guiding hand are pointing past it. Oh. Um, walking past, past it. the what? Past the, the stone in the center of town. Okay. But we should still look at the stone. Just to... I will move. I will move around it as they're yeah. looking at it. Okay. Uh, anyone who's looking at it, give me an investigation check. Alrighty. I'll join that. <sighs> Crit. Oh fuck. See <laughs> good. The fish boy knows his stuff. Oh, Yoki, it's okay. <laughs> Aren't you supposed to be Stone? like a, a, a ice? investigator? Isn't that supposed to be? A <laughs> I, I'm proficient in it. I'm sorry. I couldn't exactly allocate skill points to it. All I can do is be proficient. True. <laughs> sorry. My bad. Um, <laughs> Valley, I would never forget. Valiad, as you are looking at this thing, what you realize is that this is 20 feet by 20 feet by 80 feet, encased in no less than 18 inches of ice on all sides, solid, smooth, blank, perfectly square stone. 
And what about at the direct top? Solid, smooth, square stone. Uh, someone has read magic or something like that. This is Maybe the it's... this is the very first smooth stone you have seen anywhere in this place. It's it's not just so mm -hmm. small written. <clears throat> it's looks smooth. I don't know. Uh, no. Uh... Valiad's been reading the inscriptions all the way up to the pillar. At what point do they stop and do they say anything in particular? Well, there are there are benches around this kind of seating area, this 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 park, and all of them seem to tell the story of some important figure from the city's history. Um, each of the benches, it almost seems, was placed in dedication. To a specific important person. Six benches. Um. No, there's twelve benches. Uh, but none of them make mention of the pillar. So do does the pillar look newer? No. Like, okay. If anything, it looks much, much older. It's the first stone ever. Uh, what about on the ground, though? As, like, walking up to it. Uh, on the ground around it, uh, there are a number of different um, pieces of history talking about the, the city, talking about the mountain, talking about the, the hill giants in general. Um, it takes you a good hour of reading through different inscriptions before you find anything that mentions the pillar at all. And when you finally do, you find a portion of script that details basically that this is what is referred to as the Purity Stone. It is a reminder that all works of art, that all stone craft, all begins with blank stone. It all begins with the base element. And basically this is placed here in the center of town to remind everyone of the beginning. Okay. So, uh, I have to remain within five feet, and as I'm doing this, or remain within five feet to identify an object, mm -hmm. uh, not touch it at all. So, as I'm doing this, um, I'm remain trying to remain within the five feet of the pillar, and uh, hopefully I get something out of it. Uh, I'm using identify on it. On the pillar. Yeah, the pillar itself. Okay. Let's see here. I'll click that if you want. Which is it? So, does... Uh, does Vorian... Like, does the thing... Still point? At the yeah. thing in the middle? Yeah. Well, no, as I said, no, as you, it's pointing past it. Oh, yeah, yeah. okay. We're, I'm going. Yeah, me and, me and Vorin are going ahead and start walking yeah. past it. Okay. I mean, should... Okay, I'll, I guess I stay with Valia. Uh, Valiad, as you identify it, Valiad. what you find is that this is a piece of stone blessed by Ord. Right, that's Ord. Ord. O-R-D. Ord. Why have I heard that name before? Have, have Ord. you mentioned that? Oh. Um, um, any sort of hi history? Will that tell me? Or is uh, I'll, this I'll give religion? you a clue because it's come up a lot, and your characters would know it. Ordning, okay. Yeah. Ord is the the guy, you know. Yeah. What? The order of the giants, the ordning, was handed down from Ord. But who is Ord, is what I'm asking. The, the giants 
simply refer to him as Ord. Um, he could be viewed as the first Titan, the first god of the giants, the first giant. Um, like a Nam. A Nam all father. Oh, okay. Yeah, there's, there's a lot of dispute among historians of whether or not he was the god or whether or not he was the first giant created. Okay. Okay. But whatever so he's it was, either so he is either Anam Allfather himself under a different name mm -hmm. or the son of Anam Allfather. Yeah, the first created titan, one or the other. Um, mm. but there there's a lot of dispute over which he is, but whichever one he is, he is considered by the giants to be the progenitor, the prime word, the basis for all of who they are. Okay. And this is simply a piece, a, a massive piece of stone that carries his blessing. Great. Oh, one of Mr. X could absorb that blessing. Oh. No, they sound so evil. Oh. Why did you have to make it creepy? Oh. <laughs> like you, um, I, I'm gonna get the blessing. Yeah, I am. And there's no other mention of the trial anywhere around. No. Okay. Um, he just turns anyway. and says, "Yeah, let's move on." Very, oh, actually, mm -hmm. Mad. Sorry. Sorry. Go ahead. Uh, Mad Men does. Yes. Yeah. Or Mr. X. Do any of your personalities know of the Purity Stone? Um, His nothing. eyes roll, roll back for, uh, for a while, and you can see here like a dozen people speaking at once. And do I remember something? Uh, roll me history. Can I roll religion on that? Is that possible? Ick. I have a plus 19 to history. <sighs> Ooh, that's dirty. Well, no, this is, this is specifically Mr. X. Oh, I know. Because he's, okay. he's consulting his uh, mini lives. Uh, Golren, you wanted to roll religion on it? Oh, yeah. Uh, you can roll I'm religion with disadvantage. I actually have historian, which allows me to make a DC 15 history check and give him a proficiency bonus. Well, if plus, you give me proficiency, then, uh, then I get the 35. Don't I? No, 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 I mean... Um... I still got Mr. X. No, Mr. X on his yeah, history Yeah, Mr. X. Check. But he's already, uh, got I, he's already got expertise. What I mean is he gets, that one. he gets a plus uh, 5. He gets a plus 5 on it. No, e equal to his proficiency bonus, not uh, Mr. X's proficiency. Ah, got it. Yeah, so he gets another plus five. On hey, top of 27. Oh, 27. Okay. Yeah. yeah. With a 27, you don't remember anything. <sighs> <laughs> uh, yeah, so he, he does the, the thing where his eyes will roll back. The, the speaking and the whispers and everything is all very dramatic. And... <gasps> nope. Nope. <laughs> nope. Okay. Let's go. Uh, I remember nothing. About this, this the is trial. Very new. To be clear, what? that stone was still covered in ice, right? Yeah, the purity stones. Okay. Which means it's definitely stronger than divine. Stronger than a titan. More powerful than a titan. More important than a titan. I don't know what the the thickness of the ice means exactly yet. <laughs> it's just I imagine it's based on strength because. That's blessed by a titan or a deity. So we should just keep on moving Smash then. it and leave. We should offend the deity so it pays attention to its fucking world. <laughs> yeah, Go. Let's, let's do what each Valiant one spits one. on it. And just yes, exactly. Oh my god. Do, do you? God. No. <laughs> Are you sure? You can if you want to. Valia doesn't give a shit about deities. Nope. Maybe we should but just he's not, move on and he's not here to offend it. So, <sighs> okay, just checking. You, you you're free to do whatever you want. So, trial. You. Come down, Doc. You um, 
Yeah, you, you keep looking at the hand, and it continues guiding you past the center of town, deeper into the mountain. You follow it. Yeah. You are led another 20 minutes all the way through town, back out the other side of town, where you reach a corridor that leads to a tunnel that looks like it's leading away from this town somewhere else underground. Oh, let's continue. Are these cities interconnected? I'm wondering. Looks like it. Yeah, are, are oh. we going... For the oh, mountains, wait, I mean. Yeah, no, are, are we going deeper? Like, the deeper beneath the ground? Or are we, like... For the most part, it's now leveled off. Okay. There are occasional dips here and there, but for the most part, it's leveled off. Okay. Uh, you continue following the hand. Yep. You continue through this corridor, which, for intents and purposes, now you're realizing is a road. Mm. You continue walking, and you continue walking. And you continue walking. And you continue walking. Are we there yet? Laurie, and my feet hurt. Fairly soon, nearly eight hours have passed, and you're still walking. I will, I will give her a piggyback ride. <laughs> Yay! Okay. Uh, we're still walking after eight hours pass. Yes. Okay. Now. Where where did Old Man Blade, the Cyclops, and the, the Fire Giants stay? They've stayed in the ship, correct? Yes, on your on your aesthetic in the ship. And I have and I have a connection to my ship cu currently, correct? Um. Yes. Okay. Are they okay? <laughs> no, they died ages ago. No, no. As, as in, like you know, what are they doing? Are they? Are they just sitting tight? Don't um, you remember we had this agreement where they were going to check in every five minutes? Like, are you dead yet? But they didn't check in, so yeah, they're dead. The, the soul responds to you and basically says that um, the old one is telling stories to the two young ones. Okay. Uh, can I say to the soul if they could uh, express that we're all right? And we're still continuing on towards the trial. Um, we're not sure how much longer it'll take, but we're going. We're going through the road right now, the Stone Giant. Very well. Though okay. we are far from our goal. I. I promise you. And this is this is this is in my head, right? Mm -hmm. I'm not saying this out loud. <laughs> I promise you that once we have finished in Osterna, we will be heading directly towards the last known location of the spell gem. Then we, we should my... go to Vonenheim and stop wasting time on these outer worlds. We're doing this to get the ability to go into Bonnenheim. Yeah, old man, you don't know shit. We're young, we're hip, you we know what we're doing. You just get a bit of a annoyed response, uh, an, an annoyed silence. She's like a, a little child. I wanna go in! I wanna go now! You stomping her feet. Well, you know, Mm, that's she, not the impression I got. She, she, she's, sounds... she's been a bit annoyed since Tiawin came into the picture already. Oh, and, she's and, jealous. And now, on top of that... Your ship is jealous of Tiawin. I love and, it. And on top of that, you're not doing Beetle. what you promised to do either, so... 
You, you, okay, hang on. The giant murder thing has a name. Okay. Yeah. Cool. I don't know Soul. That. Soul of space. Well, fuck. And you showed it how to become a chaos beast. Yeah. Uh, no, it already knew that. Yeah, it's already a chaos beast. And it had just never done it before you told it it could. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, that's fantastic. I have no reason to be worried at all. Anyway, so, continuing on. Uh, it, it's been eight Do you hours. Want me to see how far this thing goes? Is, is that a, an option? I can move faster than you guys can. If it's like is a it? long. We traveled for eight hours solid and there's no end in sight, right? Mm -hmm. That's right. I mean. Yeah. Yes, do, do you have a way of communicating over longer distances? No. Traveling, do you mean? I have a no, way. Uh, if you can, if you can just go fast in one direction, tell us if there's anything at the end of it, and then then he could come back. Or he goes on ahead and he triggers a trap and dies. Oh, well, trap! I we're doubt traveling. It. It's a road. Another, <laughs> we're traveling to another city, underneath the landmass. We assume. The comp the the comp ass is telling us that we are going towards the trial and the trial area might be guarded or trapped some way. Or in the city that we, with the fact that we just left a city. The outskirts are behind us. Orion, what are you doing? What are you doing? Nothing. No, 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 no. I'm just reading. I'm just reading. <laughs> I'm just reading. <laughs> Oh, I wish we were there already. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh god. I will I will scout ahead, but I won't get too far ahead. Yeah. As soon as he starts mumbling about wishes, you leave. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. yeah. No. It's like, well, I could always wish for... Oh god. No, I, I never This is a that. flashback to when you just offered the random NPC a wish. <laughs> <sighs> so glad you didn't take advantage of that, Casey. Uh, there, there are so many other things I can take advantage of that I just left that one. But, uh, yeah, I'll run ahead. Okay. Um, how far too... ahead are you going? I mean, you're all uh, start, you, you've all been you've all been out and about. Bear in mind, it took you two or three hours to get through the city. And then you've been traveling for eight hours. You're, you're going on, you know, you're approaching Fumes. 12 hours now that you've yeah. been... Do you want to do, you want to put up a mansion and, uh... Is there of... enough space here Didn't to put up the mansion? Didn't we just talk about the yeah. potential of the mansion doors freezing? Away. Yeah, the mansion takes up no space. It's, oh, it's, it's well. not it's not the, uh, the portable tower. It just literally, a door appears and you step into nowhere. Yeah. I mean, we could just... If when we create it, we can just see whether or not ice covers it. If it doesn't, yeah, yeah. it's fine. That's you want to do mean. that? Yeah, I'll build a mansion. Okay. Anyway. You summon the mansion. Okay. The shimmering door appears. Any ice? Into my humble abode. <laughs> no, it does not freeze over. Okay, good. Let's go. You step inside Tiawan's uh, magnificent mansion. Oh boy! One one thing that you do notice is that in the mansion, it's still cold. Oh. It's not as cold as it is outside, but it's still cold in here. Mm. I have a theory. It's cold, yes. The ice doesn't seem to be targeting anything but giants. Oh, and mm. objects, and animals, and Re magical all, objects. All and... of it related to giants. My trident has nothing to do with giants. No, but your giant attacked it if it is a living ice. You don't know that. Hence the word theory. 
No, well, yeah, no, you don't actually know that he did that. I, so, so you couldn't come up with a theory that you don't know the basic. Oh, uh, didn't, didn't he just that, say my trident didn't have he, anything to do? Yeah, no, he just says that his trident is uh, uh, on ice, but you don't know why it's on ice. Then, why oh, is your... What do you mean your trident is not giant? It what is not mean? giant made. It is married. <laughs> Who is it married to? <laughs> kind of my question too. <laughs> Can Tridents get married? I didn't know that. Well, while you guys are talking about that, Vorin just goes, I'm gonna go to sleep. And then walks away. I'm conflicted. <laughs> I want to hear more about this. Did, did anybody... So, like, I went off to scout ahead and then they all decided to did sleep in the mansion. That's what happened, I, I didn't right? Know you were gonna do that. Yeah, yeah that's what that happened, is, that right? Is what happened, that's immediately yeah. what you guys did after I left. Okay, he closes I, yeah. the door yeah. behind him. Yep. <laughs> closes yeah, the door behind you, him. You left disappears. and they all went into the mansion, yeah. The thing is, once the door is... No, once the door is closed, T1 has to reopen them for them to appear. No, no, no. It, it, it appears to whoever she wants it to appear to. It's okay, I won't come back for several hours. <laughs> I assume you guys are all still traveling. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Oh, no, no, we... I, we all go to bed. No, you already so, went to sleep, Orion! <laughs> yeah, yeah, you went Tia to bed already. Up at 5 a.m. <gasps> Fantastic. <You're> okay. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to sleep. No one's um, hungry? <clears throat> Yoki, how far do you travel? How, how, uh, many, how many more hours do you do you head of, uh, head forward? For? I'll go at least two hours. Have I seen any kind of a uh, sign that this is coming to an end? Are there like markers along the tunnel? Like any any kind of anything, or is this just a bare a, tunnel with no markings? About an hour and a half in, you find the first marker. Awesome. Uh, do you read Giant? I do. Good, because it would be really bad if you got all the way out there and then didn't. <laughs> oh, shit. Um, there are two <laughs> markers on the wall. Sorry, three. Okay. One of them is marking the distance back to where you've just come from. All right. And then the other two are pointing the other direction. And one of them basically indicates half a day's journey and the other one indicates three days journey all right so it's either half a day or three days from this spot got it that is useful information i will start to make my way back to the group hoping that uh that they'll meet up behind you yeah yeah hoping not. hoping well it's okay <laughs> I love you guys anyway <laughs> you you make uh, your way all the way back it, constantly expecting to run into them heading towards you um, give me a perception check alright to right see back. if you notice the shimmery door oh, yeah. it's a um, pretty glowy shimmery door I don't yeah, know how he could fun. not Oh, as, as, as you get back to where the group, where you left the group, you believe, you see no one there, but you do see a glowing magical doorway. Well, he would know what that is, right? I don't think uh, Tia one's used the mansion since uh, at all. That's because what? I haven't used the mansion. Doesn't mean he hasn't seen one before. Yeah, that's true. I would argue at least him yeah, voting for... That, what that says yeah, then is it's, he doesn't know I'm whose mansion. Of, he might know I'm that gonna, it's a mansion then, but not know whose mansion it call, is. I'm going to call out, because it only makes sense that they're in here. Nobody else is going to be alive or any around in these tunnels. Is, is it? Are you guys in there? Can, can, you, can you, you hear me? You don't hear through the door. We can't hear you. Not the dimension. I'll kind of like try and is it like a door that you open or is it just a shimmery portal? It's a portal. Yeah, it's literally just like a... I experimentally like put my hand through it to see what will happen. <laughs> Valiad uh, sees this immediately and like slaps your hand. 
not uh, not hard, but he goes like, Ugh. oh, it's it's random right hands. <laughs> yes. Yeah, so you you <laughs> put, you put your that? hand through the door and you immediately feel someone slap it. <laughs> yeah, that's probably the group I walk in. <laughs> <laughs> like turns his back as if he weren't he wasn't just next to the door. So it took me two hours to get there. So the next city is half a day's travel plus two hours and giant. So half a day's travel for a giant, which I don't know. Actually, I probably would know. They're my favorite enemy. I should know oh, yeah. how long. You're probably looking at about a day's travel for you. Okay. Yeah. It is, May it's maybe a... we can figure out a way to go faster. For example, Borean could turn into a giant, carry us all, and then we could use magic to make him faster. I could polymorph into something and carry one of us. I like that too. By, by the way, uh, Yoki, you are absolutely beat at this point. You, um, Yoki, you've been I've got going for own... about 18 hours straight by now. I've got your own yeah. special room if you want to follow me. And a few of my servants are following me as well. <laughs> got like food and just drinks and... What is this fun. place? Is I take like water and just start chugging it? All of the <laughs> All of these spirits have just random uh, musical instruments that they look to be playing, although they're not making any sound. I think their instruments My are... My mansion, Casey, not your mansion. <laughs> I think their instruments are broken. They, they don't know how to play really music. Happening. They, they only Stop. know the motions. Stop holding instruments. They all look very, like, elven as well. Like, very large ears, long hair. But they're kind of, like, ghost-looking. They're just kind of like one's massaging your shoulders, the other one's like giving you food as we're walking down a corridor to your room. I like this place. <laughs> Where are we? This is this is my mansion. I call it Tewin's mansion. Why? Very original. Yes. Are you just discovering this place now. <laughs> well, it's it's always been in my head, I guess, but never out in the world. Not good with words right now. I'm very so tired. We've been walking a while. So we're in your head now. Okay. All right. Yeah, you're in my head. Here's your room. And like open the door and there's like just this enormous room with big fluffy bed. There's a spa in the corner. There's like a vanity. There's just, it just looks awesome. Mirror like a, like a um, studio apartment looking sort of. A spa like, with cold want... water because like, of the spell. Like a penthouse. No, it's just like a little bit of steam, there's a little fireplace, couches nearby. Okay, this is your room. This is all for you. Thank you. You're welcome. I close the door. Leave two of the servants with him. How many servants do I get? I don't actually know. Quite a few. A hundred. Yeah. You get a lot, don't I? Yeah. yeah. Cool. Okay. Cool. The night passes. Well, before we go to sleep, though, never mind. I, I would, <laughs> yeah, we're going slowly but steady forward, Casey. <laughs> very, very, very slowly. I, I would, I would like to try to scry for uh, Swel, Sweltlem, the old man Winter, basically. Sweltlem, how do you pronounce that? Sweltlem. Sweltlem. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Isn't that like a Nordic name? Shouldn't you know how to pronounce that? That's not a Nordic name. That's a uh, English person, uh, person yeah. trying to write a Nordic name because he thinks we talk <laughs> like that. It's nowhere close to a Nordic <laughs> name. <laughs> <laughs> well, so yeah, more like you, like I'll be right Russian back. or something to yeah, me. Let, let's put a TH in there because why not? Yeah. <laughs> TH is a English thing, so... No, it is a Swedish giant thing. name, not a Nordic <laughs> name. <laughs> well, <coughs> they uh, they put Ud in S Swedish from, uh, from Ordning. Ordning. Ordning is uh, kind of Swedish, actually, a Norwegian. It, it is Swedish. Then, if you guys all have st stolen one of Swedish. our words, then that's entirely. How do you How dish. do you know you didn't steal it from the giants? Uh, because we killed the frost giants, the Swedes did, and so you're then admitting we... that they were here before you. Well, I mean, 
So you they admitted you to stole be. from them. Yeah. I mean, we took... <laughs> I <laughs> think you <laughs> <I> killed it. <laughs> so you <laughs> killed him and then stole from him. Um, bye bye, I think you should give this up. Help me. <laughs> no, 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 no. You're on your own. You don't get a <laughs> lawyer here. You dug this grave. You keep digging, boy. Yeah. So, so you're admitting that you stole your language from the giants. A, a dead you race, you mean. Yeah. After you killed them. Uh, Is that no. the ones that Zeus? Wait. Okay. Oh, you're, you're in the whole wrong part of the world. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Thor, hey. baby. Thor. Thor. That's the one. Odin. Thor. Odin. 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 Odin killed the frost. Thor killed the giants. Yeah. Oh, no, no. Odin did. Odin killed Odin. the frost giants. That's what we, we, we just need to find Odin. Tewin has this. <laughs> <laughs> Tewin has this like premonition, like in the middle of the night. Yeah, there, there are find no, Odin and there are a massacre number of all the giants. Right? There are a Boring. number of Boring. spheres where, where those deities are worshipped. Wait, wait, I know how to solve this. We just need to find Odin. <laughs> Be quiet, go what? sleep! <laughs> See, yeah, stop getting, realizing stuff all the time. You wouldn't hear that the room is soundproofed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can imagine why it needs to oh, be Oh, so you're so you're play testing that new uh, giant form then? <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever seen that um that picture of the hamster eating the banana? Jimmy, Jimmy, how thick do you make the doors? What? <laughs> how thick do you make the doors? Um, think of like old style, like dungeon, like the the wood panels. So like, like four or five okay. inches. Okay. So Valiant's watching on the other side, like. No. Oh. Why? Why? Oh. Why? Why? Wow. Oh, that's nasty. No. Go to bed. Why are you watching? <laughs> he doesn't need to. <laughs> I'm scared of what that picture is, Madman, that you just sent. Yeah, I'm not opening that. Nope. Um, nope. <laughs> the hamster eating the banana. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking of. Cute. <laughs> <laughs> this oh, with what's your dog's balls? Um, your your scrying <laughs> comes back with nothing. <laughs> nothing? Okay. <laughs> um, just something worth pointing out. Yeah. <laughs> the first sentence of scry. <laughs> <laughs> We're in a dungeon. Oh, okay, okay. You just step out of the mansion. But, 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 uh, but, uh, hang on. But, yeah, lots of but, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. That's, that's yep. what Valiad's saying right now. Oh! Wait, no, never mind. <laughs> What's the problem? Just step out of the mansion. Door's still open. Oh. You can open and close. Yeah, when you see you that? Get... You see that? When yeah. Did you get that? <laughs> At level six. Oh, I, not, <laughs> I had not noticed that one. Yeah. Okay. As soon as someone steps out the door, Valley, I keeps closing it on them. <laughs> <laughs> so every time they open it, he's like closing it. So it's just a back and forth. In like, that case, okay. yes. can you order your giant to go to sleep? Or at least stay in his room. Hang on, guys, we're about to get yeah. some cool scrying here. In that case, uh, Mr. X, give me a wisdom save. Okay, I have Valiad. advantage on this. Valiad's room space 